players, they, they, they both feel like, you know, they're kind of on that cusp of like, you know, like, like, like I don't know, top what? whatever, oh, okay. right, okay. in the world. Battlefield. I actually flipped yeah. for a second. <laughs> huh? Did yeah, we switch to hijinks and I didn't know? And you didn't know? Yeah, they're just, it's just the, uh, the aesthetic. Yeah, okay. It's I gotta say, that. Uh, this is a beauty, yeah, this is hand warmers. I gotta say, this is a beautiful aesthetic, too. Look at it. Look at the jungle in the background. It looks, the water even looking more realistic than in Melee. The, 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 the colors of the jungle look a little more lush than we're used to, you know? Yeah. This it is, really uh, gives you that. Monsoon, monsoon season just hit. You see, we got a lot of green in the background. Yeah. It actually looks humid. It looks humid. It looks like if you were there, you could feel like, wow, it'd be warm, you know? Yeah. It feels and like it'd be warm and, warm wet. and wet. Yeah, it feels <laughs> like you're going to get splashed. I kind of don't want to be there and I think about it. I want to be kicking it in that, that hut. Yeah? I want to be kicking it in that hut. Yeah. With like a cold beverage. What about like one of those uh those water floaties? Chilling down the river? Oh, well, until you I hit that know. waterfall. There's I forgot waterfall. about the waterfall. And there's waterfall a there. lot of rocks. <laughs> there's a lot of rocks. This oh, looks like man. a, you ever got whitewater rafting? They got the levels. This looks like a level five or a level six. Ooh. Yeah. Are you, are you experienced enough to go to level five I or six? No. I actually it was funny. I had a friend. He was a coworker. He went. Uh, he did white water rafting for a bachelor party. He did the level five or whatever. And oh. he came back from the weekend. He's like, I was like, Yo, did you have fun? You know, white water rafting your bachelor party. He's like, I did have fun, but I would not do it again. Oh. He was like, One of us almost died. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Their boat flipped apparently, and one of his friends got stuck under the boat, and um, like, and he he needed someone else to flip the boat for him because he was you're trapped. Because like, like, he would have <laughs> drowned. Yeah. yeah. And and if and if none of them had noticed, because they were like looking around, like because they all got flipped, right? And so they, they noticed in time to, to, to save him, but he was, like, stuck. And so, <laughs> and, you know, and there's, like, rocks and everything, right? Yeah, and so he was saying, like, yeah, I, I had fun, but I'm not going again. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe just dial it back to a dial level it back. three. I actually did White Run after one time. I did a level three. It was super fun. Okay. So so three three seems to be the three point. Three seems like the That's sweet the spot. sweet spot. Yeah. yeah. You want to be a threes. Right. Okay. Rule threes. Rule threes. Or whatever, you know? <laughs> All right, so, yeah, here we go. Wrath and, uh, Wrath and Mystery, game one. Oh, and okay, so I guess the, that was just for the hand warmer. Yeah, on that the, was uh, literally just for the hand warmer. James. Wow, Mystery counter in the first five seconds. Unbelievable. I wonder if that can actually be a anti-spin dash, right? Maybe. I feel like Sonic is just so fast that if you don't, that as soon as you activate the counter, you're already on the other side. I mean, you do it on reaction. Like, you do it when you see him coming at you. I, well, I mean, like, when, when, time. when Spin Dash actually hits your counter, oh, you're I already see. gone. Oh, I see. Yeah, maybe you're right. Yeah, he's just like, yeah, I don't know how that interaction works. Oh, oh that, that, that could be to grab? What? Yeah. Like, like uh, how do you say, like, first hit? Yeah, upper one. Upper one. Okay, okay. Well, let's see. Yeah, I like right the, now. the way that Mr. E is really, like, keeping himself planted. Yeah. Making sure that Wrath is the one approaching him. Of course, being Sonic, he's going to be all over this stage. Right. Really trying to overwhelm Mr. E. Yeah, but, you know, the in terms of the hitboxes, that was awesome. Really good use of that that uh, counter hitbox. Wow. Yeah, and covering the, uh, the, the roll in with an up tilt. Super, super solid ledge trapping. I feel like that down air was really uh, unorthodox, right? Un yes. <laughs> I, I did not expect a. Oh, oh, wow. Getting a follow up here. And I think he could have done a forward there, even. Okay, right. well, Spin Dash is going to connect to punish that whiff counter. Right. Another Spin Dash into a with, forwarder. With counter. With yeah. counter. That sucks. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, Mystery, I mean, I think overall the game plan's been pretty solid. Just keep him out. Okay, down tilt. Oh, okay. Mystery trying to chase for another down tilt. Maybe push Wrath a little bit closer to the ledge. Right. Wrath answering right back with an F tilt. Yeah. Ooh. He's been doing that downer. Look at that. Yeah, and, and, and you see Wrath now being like, all right, I got to respect it. Like, I don't want to come in. Even dropping with a with a shield breaker. Yep. Oof. Oh, okay. Not quite. Close. Maybe revealing that card just a little bit too early. Okay, there's the down tilt chases. Ooh. No way. Wow. That was almost center stage. Wow, oh. yeah, that's awesome. Seems like it's a, just a pretty solid, you know, combo route that you can take. I haven't eat. seen any other Sonic do that. Yeah, it's interesting. Falling up air one just pops him up enough to, to get the grab. Get the grab, yeah. Does have like static launch because it's multi hit? Yeah, yeah. Oh, <laughs> got up and shielded. Maybe, maybe um, Wrath might have been expecting uh, Mystery to try to go for a B or something there. 
but good punish on the homing attack. Wrath trying to make Mystery a little bit uncomfortable with the amount of time that he was charging it. Nice. Very good reaction on the roll there. Wow, and run off forward air. That's actually going to do it. Taking the stock at 85 after the forward air. Really, really low percent there. Obviously, Wrath with a lot of rage right now, so that is going to help with his knockback. Down to the floor is going to just clip Sonic. Oh, falls out of the air. Low profiling the homing attack. Okay, now Mr. E is starting to decide the stage again. Homing attack or mm -hmm. spin dash. There's the falling up air. Wrath kind of just in uh, in the wrong place at the wrong time. And the thing about that back air is like when Mystery e zones him out with his aerials, the problem with back air is that it, it, it looks like it has an arc where Sonic can actually squeeze under it when he's in the spin dash form. Oh my god. Yeah. Forward smash will take the sock. Yeah, getting the clank and it's going to go in Wrath's favor. He's maintaining his stage position. Okay, getting the oh. extended, extended depth tilt, answering right back with the, with the back air. Mm -hmm. And Wrath is just all over Mr. E. Oh, is he going to, okay, nice tech, but now the early up be that time. Wow. And you actually see Mr. E kind of like jumping up in his chair. You got to make sure you get the perfect timing. Yeah. Especially with those techs. Oh, Another again. tech. I mean, even so when he gets, a, he gets a tech, you know, he's immediately double jumping right back into the stage. Right. I was going to say, before long, like, you know, he's not going to be able to go for it anymore because it's going to be untechable. That's going to do it. Cleans it up. Mr. E dropping game one to Wrath. A lot of, uh, you know, a lot of solid play at the beginning of that game gave him an early lead, but Wrath figuring it out. Yeah, of course, Wrath is the higher seed of this bracket. Mm -hmm. So he's the one projected to take the set over Mr. E. But Mr. E is a person to, uh, to surprise. You know, he's made upsets in the past. Definitely. That's how he's gotten this far um, in his career. Yeah. And definitely, definitely a player that, you know, he's been very much like a soul. Well, I know he's kind of dabbled in some of the other sword characters, but by and large, right? Yeah. We've seen a specialist die hard. Before that, it was Marth. Right. Okay, so no surprise from the characters that we have here. The stage going to be Pokemon, Pokemon Stadium, Stadium 2. How do you feel about Pokemon Stadium 2 versus 1? Two versus one. Yeah. I mean, the big difference between playing this stage and this game versus like in melee is that you know no stage transforms because yeah. you put the hazards off. Uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> it feels the same, honestly. <laughs> feels the same. Okay. Oh, I actually have one complaint about PS2. The 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 freaking screen in the back sometimes it looks like it looks like it's too. You know what I mean? It looks like it's part of the action. It's like too clear almost. It feels like it's like. <laughs> it's too high def? It's too high def. Yeah, it's too high def. PS1, it's like really obvious that it's like in the. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> I've kind of gotten used to it, but I remember when, I, when the game first came out, I was a little bit annoyed by it. <laughs> okay, that's that's actually hilarious. <laughs> well, Mr. E's been taking a good amount of damage from Wrath. Uh, staying pretty, pretty healthy uh -huh. for his first stock. Uh yeah, there's looks like there's some, oh that's wow. a big back air. Awesome yeah, back air at that. Looks like there's some aerials that like are less reliable at walling out because I mean you know Mystery wants to wall him out right. Yes. But like the nair and the back air in particular, it looks like those are two aerials that he can Wrath can kind of squeeze under, um, so they're like less reliable than the down air or the forward air. I mean, you definitely want to do forward air, down air, even up air if you're you know you expect Wrath to try and run under him. Right. Oh, big whiff there on that forward smash. Dang, no punish. Oh. Mr. E, forward tilt the wrong way. That had to have been a tech, uh, technical flub. Yeah, back air going to whip. Yeah, oh. and Rath kind of pulling away with it right now. Mr. E's got to have an answer. Yeah, chipping away at the shield. Yeah. yeah. Like, I, I like that Mr. E's chipping away at the shield, but at the same time, Rath can just reset on the other side of the stage. Right. It doesn't seem like that's going to be a tool that Mr. E's going to be able to utilize too much in this matchup. Right. Yeah, I do like the down tilts and the extended F tilts. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, okay. Can okay. He catch an air dodge? No. Wrath doesn't give it to him. He just goes all the way to the other side of the stage. Yeah, they're retreating from Wrath. Seems really difficult to deal with for Mr. E. Pokemon Stadium is sort of a wide stage. Yeah, and there's the whip punish. Uh, and, and there, right? First hit of Nair comes out. Uh, spin dash connecting before the second hit of Nair. So he's actually squeezing in in between the two hits. Okay, but a down air does land for Mr. E. We see up throw. Ooh. 
Not Fire Emblem KO yet. Throw. Not enough. Yeah, wow. Yeah, all of the little, the little itty bitty ways Rath is mixing up how he comes out of that move. He's catching this three and getting a really low percent KO with that forward smash. Hey, a forward air connects. Mr. E is center stage, but all oh, the extended F tilt not gonna get punished. Homing attack connects. Ooh, yep. Yeah, he's he's out of there. Oh, finally. Four tilt connecting. But Wrath with over a one stock lead right now. And it's talking some change. It took three minutes to take that one stock. That's that's a lot of work you gotta put in. Especially if you're have a whole stock deficit. Yeah. Nothing kind of going his way. There's the first successful counter we've seen. We did see Mystery kind of going for it earlier in the set. Even the way he had to position that seemed a little bit more difficult than usual. He had to drift back with yeah. Wrath and counter. Right. Right, but this has been a solid stock so far. If he does get a, oh, some damage over the side B. Obviously, he can't connect to the fourth hit. Ooh, the combo, though. And getting double up air off of Nair conversion. Yeah. Mystery could really, yeah, see that Nair, man. That Nair looks like it's kind of unreliable at dealing with the spin dash. Wow. Spin dash into up air. Yeah, this, spin this dash is, oh, action. he baits out the air dodge. Forners him off stage. Can he get something here? No, not quite. He's going to have to retreat back to stage. True, we're wrapped. We're sitting pretty uh. in this position. 104% still two stocks. Mr. E fighting with 140. Oh, well placed. Wow. And that was just a solid play from Rath, especially once he got that adaptation game one. Mm -hmm. And then he just kind of ran with that same energy yes. all the way to finish yes. the set. Well, congratulations to Rath. Congratulations that, to Rath. I feel like that was to make it out of the, of the pool. Because they had to be. They been. were the top yeah, two no, seeds. There's no way that was anything before winter semis, so. But yeah, congratulations, Rath. Mr. E going to drop down to losers. That was still... I mean, that was very um, educational when it comes to the Educational. That, was, that is the word I would use Edutainment. for it. Entertainment. 